In this tutorial, I will show how to create a retro, or vintage effect. Now then, once you are ready, make a duplicate layer, by dragging it down to the copy option, or press Ctrl or Command J on a Windows or Mac respectively. Now right click on the copy layer, and select convert to smart object. Then go to filter, and lens correction. In the properties, click on the custom tab. Change the vignette amount to minus 100, and press OK. Now double click on the little icon, next to lens correction, under the copy layer. In the blending option window, change the opacity to 80%, and press OK. Now click on the adjustment button and select solid color. In the picker properties type in, 0, 0, 0, C, 4, 2, and press OK. Then go to Blending Options and select Exclusion. Now click on the Adjustment button again and select Solid Color. This time type in D, 0, A, 4, 5, F, and press OK. Change its Blend Mode to Soft Light, and change the Opacity to 40%. Then go to Adjustments, and select Brightness and Contrast. Check on Use Legacy, and increase the contrast to 10. And that is how you can give any image a retro, or a vintage effect.